I am making a garlic and anchovy rub turkey, which is a little bit like a Provencal leg of lamb, except, you know, Thanksgiving appropriate. This is the first Thanksgiving that I'm cooking without my dad. It was something that we always did together. You know, it was a very special time. And one of the things we always did together was make the turkey. Usually I say do this till your hands get tired, but in this case, it's like you gotta push beyond tired. You just like, you have to collapse. You're just gonna use the whole can. Living with Melissa Clark, there's anchovy in everything. I like eating turkey, but she's experimenting with a whole lot of things. I wouldn't be surprised if this is chicken. Is this chicken? So I'm making little slits because I'm going to stuff this anchovy paste right in there. I'm not gonna do this with the breast though because the breast is delicate and if I put little slits all over the breast, it would overcook. And then, gotta season your bird all over. I'm not going to put the wings underneath the bird and I'm not gonna tie up the legs. But what I am gonna do is I'm gonna leave it uncovered just like this and I'm gonna put it in the fridge overnight. And that way it gives it a chance to dry out and the skin will get really crisp and golden. I like white meat and I like dark meat. I really do like the whole bird. <laughs> Turkey's never my favorite part of the Thanksgiving meal, you know, I'd always much rather eat the stuffing or really the salad. But this year, this turkey with the anchovies and the garlic, it's actually, I think it might be my favorite dish, especially the turkey butt. I prefer the salty, crispy things on the plate. Like chicken skin? Like turkey skin. When I was doing the recipes for the Times this year, knowing that this was gonna be the first year that I wasn't gonna be cooking it with my dad, I kept him in my head the whole time. I feel like my dad would have been so psyched to sit down to this meal. He would have loved it.